Player 2 has entered the game. What is up Vikings? I am Player 2 and today we're going to learn how to build the brightest Viking lighthouse or brazier to light up a village. I've seen some pretty cool designs, but this one is the most simplistic and easiest to see from greater distances. There are some pretty important steps to build it correctly, so make sure to follow each one. And keep in mind that if Valheim tips, news, and gameplay butters your biscuit, consider subscribing. I upload new Valheim videos almost every day, stream it live to play with my community, and discuss it in our Discord. All links are in the description below. Okay. So the first thing you want to do is find the perfect location. If you're building this as a brazier to light up your small village, location doesn't matter so much. But if you're using this as a lighthouse to signify that you're close to your shore, then you need to make sure that you build it at a location where it's easily visible while making your way in from the sea. This will not work on the boulders you find along the shoreline. It must be on land that can be terraformed. You can usually find small islands offshore of most land masses. They will do fine. Place down a workbench. Then the first two things you will need to get started is a hoe and a good amount of stone. Using the hoe, right click and choose the option to raise ground. Now look down at your feet. Do not move the cursor and raise the ground to your desired height. Now craft a 2 meter beam as centered as possible atop the tower. You'll know it's right if it's pretty flush with the edges. Next, build three 1 meter beams clipped onto the end of that 2 meter beam. One vertically and two horizontally like so. And make sure that you build them as shown, otherwise the rest of your build isn't going to work. Now from the outermost beam, Connect another 1 meter beam, but angle it one tick inwards using your middle mouse wheel. Continue this pattern all the way around till you complete a full circle. If it starts to crumble once you get towards the end, just start from the other side to finish it. Next, begin to place vertical 1 meter beams connected at every two notches. Try to have them face the center as much as possible. After that, Start a second circle that begins from the bottom of those beams, match it to the one above it. Now we're almost done with the base, just need to add some structure. Pull up your 45 degree wood beams, connect them to the bottom of your ring at all of the vertical beam locations. Now you can add your fire. Head to the top of your structure and destroy the wood beams inside of the circle that we made, you're not going to need those anymore. Next, pull up the bonfire in your building tab. Make sure you have one sirling core, which you can easily find in dungeons in the Black Forest, five fine wood from chopping down birch trees in the meadows biome, and seven core wood from chopping down pine trees in the Black Forest. You only need five to build the bonfire, but we will need the other two to finish the building of this tower. Now, before you light the fire, we need to add one final piece, the arms. Using 26 degree wood beams, you want to place the first one parallel to your beam you're attaching it to. Then go two ticks inward on the middle mouse wheel for the next. Do this until you have five pieces spiraling upwards. Now, the fifth piece will crumble and fall without any support. This is where the two extra core wood are going to come into play. At the fourth beam up, build one log pole and connect it to the ring. This will provide enough structure for the remaining arms to be completed. For the next one, move over three notches and begin placing four 26 degree beams. Then add another arm with three and one more with two. Now once I was finished with this part, I destroyed my makeshift scaffolds that I was using to climb up and down the tower. You can do or add whatever you'd like here, and in fact, I'd like to see what additions you add to this build. We have a discord of over 500 with plenty of Valheim players posting their builds. Link is in the description below. I will see you in the next one.